All right, guys, these are your resistance band uh, crunches. Now, we're going to actually, or cable crunches, supine. So meaning we're going to be face up for these. There's other cable crunches where you're actually um, facing the floor, but these are supine. So we're face up like a sit up position, okay? Um, and we're going to put either the cable or the band that we're using at the lowest setting on the cable stack or on the door, um, so underneath the door. And then you're going to lay just like you're going to do a sit up or a crunch, okay? Um, and all of the crunch and sit up rules are going to apply. So our core is nice and tight. We're rotating our hips in, so we're activating our core. And then when we crunch, I want you to just think of um, if this was the top of my rib cage, right? That all I'm doing is turning my ribs in. It's not a huge move. We're not pulling with our neck. We're just thinking of um, hinging right here and turning our rib cage into where it rotates into our hips, okay? I'm just hinging right there. I'm driving the top of our rib cage right here down as far as we can into um, our waistline, okay? We're not gonna pull with our um, neck and it's always best to keep your shoulders back, not hunched forward, because those wider shoulders actually help you um, not pull with your neck quite so much. So it looks like I'm a little out of frame here. You're also going to wanna scoot up to where your head is very close to the cable stack. Okay, so just far enough that when we slide, um, when we go up into the, the crunch and it pulls the cable that when we are then back to the starting position, which this would be the starting position, um, we are not slamming the, the weights on the cable stack, right? Um, or in the case of the bands, you know, just far enough that we have some good resistance to start with. So I already have some resistance. You can see if I just relax, the band is going to pull me back. So, and then you're going to just hold your hands. Remember, shoulders kind of wide, not hunched over. Hold your hands right there at your chest level, and then you're going to just crunch up, push out, come back down. Crunch up, come back down. Just that small movement of rotating your rib cage into your waistline. Now, I may have this as a time under tension, so watch for that. Most likely it'll be the isometric hold that I have you in tension or um, under time for, and then come back down. But those are your supine cable crunches. Enjoy.